Hey y'all, so sometimes people ask me how I found my niche. I can't really say that I found it because it, to be honest, I've, I've always kind of been this way. Um, I have always had the savvy mindset where I think around things and I get solutions to what I need uh, no matter what. I, I find a way. I have always been that way. I've always been against the grain. I've always been a bit... Uh, of a rugged individualist. I've always been the type that didn't really want to follow the rules because I kind of saw that there was a better way and I just kind of did the better way, you know, and that's been unpopular throughout my life, but I still got shit done. And I've come farther that way <laughs> than I have just uh, letting myself get crushed under some stifling ass shit that didn't make any sense to me. So <clears throat> it's a very independent lifestyle. You know, this is not something you can do in a group. <laughs> but um, the, it's just the way that I've always been, and I think it's helpful to teach other women how to do this because you have not been taught how to stand up for yourself, how to protect yourself, how to think things through, how to be prepared, how to have backup plans, how to think around things, think around obstacles, work around barriers, you know, work around people telling you no and shit like that and think that's not possible or we can't do that or so-and-so's not here, you know, so-and-so can't help you, whatever. <clears throat> All those excuses that people in life give you for things, you know, for, for you not being able to do something. Oh, well, you can't because blah, 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 blah. So-and-so won't allow for that. <clears throat> I'll just work around so-and-so, you know, it's like, it's things like that. So, um, that's, you know, that's just something I've, I've always been, I've always been that way. <clears throat> and I would like for y'all to learn how to do those things as well because um, bowing your head and just like doing as you're told all the time and just kind of like barely getting through life with, um, you know, one or two solutions, you know, here and there, there's no way to live. I don't want you to be stuck that way. And I would rather you um, have take, take advantage of all the avenues that you have that lie before you and to uh, think outside the box and always protect yourself and always look after yourself. Um, especially if you have children, this is important to, to look after you and put you first so that you can uh, take better care of your children or anyone who's relying on you. And uh, that's, that's important for all of you. And I don't want women to feel like they're on, on the bottom anymore of life. I don't want them to feel unsuccessful. I don't want them to know. I want them to no longer feel like they don't have any options or they're not going to be able to do what they want with their life because they've got to do what somebody else wants. None of that is true. You don't have to live that way. And I would rather you be empowered and, and believe in yourself and know that you can get through a situation and get what you want and get the solution you want and get the outcome you want. No matter what, you just have to think through it, think through it a certain way with cunning and savvy and, um, you know, and, and think outside the box. And that those are all the kinds of things I teach, um, especially in the 12 weeks, if you want to go deep with me and we can really iron the shit out for real and just get you transformed into somebody who, who doesn't take no for an answer, who has control in her life. Shit works out for her no matter what. And, and she doesn't have to take no for an answer. And if there's something she wants in her life, she can pursue it and take it because it should be hers anyway. It should be yours. And, uh, I think that's the way you should live. So, I have always thought that way and I've always been able to think around things and get around obstacles and people telling me no and shit like that. And I, that's just how I do. So, um, I like to see other women do the same thing and figure it out and put themselves at the top of their life and be on their A game and just live how they want to live.